This video assumes that you have Cheat Engine. I have 7.6 for this video. Download and extract the game uh, Cheat Engine table. Run the Cheat Engine table. Attach the game. Open. Click on this. It might take a while to populate the first time. A couple of fun ones. Statistics. If you click on Stamina, you will always have instant recharge of Stamina. I think it can go into the negatives. I don't remember. It's been a while. Hero. Animation. You can change your animation speed to 3x, 10x, whatever. Just remember that if you do it like a parry or a post or door open animation, um, your character is doing the animation faster, not the animation itself. Um, so if you parry repost, uh, you still have to wait for the repost animation to go through and you can't just keep attacking, you have to wait. Um, it's a lot of fun to just run around and just beat the shit out of enemies. Uh, character flags, the um, no hit so that you won't get hit. Um, you can make it so that they don't attack you. Um, you can just throw infinite firebombs. You can um, fly around the map. You can not get hit at all. Or you. I think this is you don't take damage, but you still get hit. Uh, this is a good one for practicing parries or dodging. World flags, NPCs. Um, this allows you to um, kill or respawn enemies that you might have accidentally killed or pissed off. If it's been killed, you click one, click it again, and it will respawn the ally. I think you have to log out, come back in, and it should work. Um, scripts, build creation, add souls. I added a bunch of souls. All you have to do is change this parameter. We'll say 99, and then add souls, and it will give us 99 souls. I'm already maxed out, so it's not going to show up. Item gib. This is how you spawn in items. You click on how many of what you want, infusion type, um, quantity, durability. You can spawn in a bunch of broken items and then click on spawn item and it will pop up in your inventory like crystal gems. And I will say 10 spawn item, 10 crystal gems. Functions, item drop, you can drop the items below you instead of spawning it in into your inventory. Um, NPC menus, bonfire, travel, this allows you to travel anywhere in the game. Let's go to the cleansing chapel. Sorry for the potato computer. You can do many things should you wish. Reallocate stats, kind of not necessary since you can edit your own stats, but those are the fun things to mess around with. Obviously there are a lot of settings, so feel free to do what you will. Good luck, have fun, and um, don't be online. You will get banned.